Hi there! I'm Preeti and I'm back with another review. Today I'm going to have a quick review about the Grimm's uh, Sloping Blocks. That's this set here. It's a set of 15 colors and 30 blocks, two in each color. We reorganize it to be a bit more rainbowy than what you'll see when it comes package wrapped to you. And I'll pull out them. So they're all different sizes. They measure they all measure eight centimeters this way, but their widths vary. So these are eight by eight. We have eight by five, eight by six, eight by seven, and eight by eight again. These are really great blocks if you are building and you want to do ball runs. You can see that they have all different slopes. That's why it's called a sloping block set. It's kind of an underrated block set because you don't hear people talking about it that much. Um, this one's really fun. It has some really cool grain on it too. That was super fun. You can kind of see it, maybe. Oh, hard to see with orange. Um, this set is almost matching to the regular rainbow, although if you'll see that there are some pastel colors in here, uh, notably the yellow, the light purple, and the pink. Um, so it's not quite exactly to the rainbow, and it's not quite exactly to the pastel rainbow. It's a little bit in between since it's 15 colors. Um, I'll show you some. And you can kind of mix and match them when you put them back in place. So it's also a really fun game of stacking and seeing how far you can stack high before it topples over. And then putting it back together for younger children, it's great because they can color match them together. For older children, they can see if they can make other perfect rectangular sets and still put them into the tray. So I really love them. We just got them. Um, so we're really excited to use them with building ball runs or anything that we want that needs to have a bit of a slope to go down. Even sometimes when you're building, you need a filler piece. So some you see are really thin and then some are super thick. These two here, these two are their thickest box, the red ones. And again, as usual, they have the Grimm's have a beautiful chamfering edging on all of the edges and really cool grain. Some of the grains you can see on the light colors really well. I have one that's a little budding. Um, and as usual, you should expect some color transfer on them. I'm just going to stick them here. And yeah, that's, uh, that's about a little quick summary of the sleeping blocks. They range in price from about $80 to $100. And I've got some links below um, in the description where you can purchase them if you are in Canada or the United States. So thanks for joining and check out our other reviews. Bye.